Hey, welcome back to the show. Grab some crackers. You'll want to scoop up this delicious recipe. Mm -hmm. Compliments of our resident foodie and great friend of the show, Chef Shania, a.k.a. Shane Rogers. Great yes. to see you, Shane. Let's just jump right in. Let's what are we doing? Let's get in there. We're going to make some crawfish dish Done. for a little Mardi Gras celebration. I love it. We've got... Did you bring your beads? I didn't, but that would have been awesome. What? Maybe we need to go earn some. <laughs> oh, now we're th that's, that's Virginia this evening. <laughs> right, right. Okay. I forgot. You know I can't be trusted. Hello. So we've got uh, half a red bell pepper. Yep. We've got a white onion, a small one. We've Love got it. some celery. <laughs> All in one pot. A couple of tablespoons of butter in there. You got this on about medium high. We're going to put some garlic in there. You know, when you hear the word dip, I think immediately of unhealthy, but this is doesn't this look This is not going to be great, but it's not going to be terrible either. For It's going to taste delicious, but it's not yeah, going to be yeah, the most yeah. healthy thing. Dump everything in. We've got a jalapeno in Done. there, some garlic, a little bit of salt. Love it. Some pepper, about half as much pepper, and mm -hmm. a little bit of cayenne pepper. I mean, it is something from New Orleans. Yeah. So anyway, give that a little stir. Cook that for about six minutes. You end up with this. Six minutes. Yes. It's, it looks like it's a little bit of reduction going yeah, on. Yeah, it's a little. It's just, just a relaxed a little bit. The relaxed. onions are translucent. Okay. It's, it's New Orleans. What do you want? <laughs> so then we got a an eight ounce block of cream cheese, and okay. I did use the lighter cream cheese. Like you can't tell the difference when you get done. We're gonna add some cheese too. Okay, wonderful. Um, to get this softened up, I did use my trick of sticking it in the microwave for just a little bit. Um, we're gonna add the um, sautéed vegetables right mm -hmm. down in there. And that'll help soften it, too. And we're going to put this recipe right up on our website, yeah. WTVR.com slash VTM. Mm -hmm. Now we're going right through this, but you'll have all of the, uh, have all the different ingredients in particular, yeah. all the some information. Some shredded sharp cheddar cheese. Sharp cheddar. And this is the star of the dish. It's mm. some crawfish. Now, since we are in Virginia, not New Orleans, I did have to get this frozen in thought. But um, they have it. I actually, my favorite place, or best place to find it is Walmart. Is in it the really? Section. I it, always find it there. Do you, do you think crawfish gets a little bad rap? It does. It does. But it's delicious. It's totally it, it delicious. It looks a little funky. It's, it's like it a small lobster. It does look a little funky. It does. Right? right? But it's delicious. Mm -hmm. And, you know, you know, what are you going to do? With this crawfish, does it come in a pound bag, two it comes pound in a pound bag, one pound bag? Is that what it, you're using that's, here? I used a pound there. Okay. Uh, okay. Maybe 12 ounces, I'm not 12 sure, ounces. but uh, no, I've used a pound. A okay. uh, couple of tablespoons of Creole mustard because Creole is, mustard? Yeah, you got to use the good stuff. Where did we get this? You get that in the regular condiment section. Creole mustard. It has little, a little bit of a kick as well? Yeah, and it's grainy. And mm. we've got your favorite sriracha. Sriracha. Mm. And some heavy cream. So that's where we... That's well, why I used the light. But but, but it's, it's not a lot, though. Shay. No, it's a quarter of a cup. Quarter of a cup. I mean, yeah. over, over time, Two moderation... Ounces. I mean, I could see if you ate this entire thing, but yeah. that's not too bad at all. So preheat your oven to 350. Okay. Give this a good mix, and luckily I have some for us in the mic or in the oven already. So, so we'll this is not done. You have to put this in. This is not in. done. You have okay. to bake it for about 35 minutes. Anyway, and let's go get it out of the oven. Yeah, I'll let's show do you what that. to do. We got about with 30 it. seconds right all here. Right. We'll switch places. Is that crawfish cooked once you get it from the uh It's already cooked, but you store? want to cook I'll it a get little this bit. For Oop, you. Thank all right. you. That's pretty hot. Watch out. So when you get it out. It's like a ballet over here. It is. Top it with some fresh parsley. Oh, yes. All right, let's dig in right here. What is this? Some fresh lemon juice. Need the fresh lemon. And I love it. Give it a little stir. You just give me the spoon. I'll have that whole I'll thing with you, a little extra. <laughs> I'll give you the spoon. There we go. I'll give you a let's cracker. Let's dig in right here. Hey, we want to thank all of our guests here in Virginia this morning. How about a little squirt of uh, oh, all sriracha right, sure. right there? We love it. Thanks for being here, Shane. You're welcome. As always. Mmm. Knocking my socks off. Let's do it. Mm.